Major Slack videos. Yeah, <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> Shut up, Pee Wee. Okay. Well, yeah, my name is Major Slack. Thanks for joining me again. And here we are in Sanctuary playing Borderlands 2, and we're playing as Maya. And I jumped ahead just a tiny little bit. I didn't do anything here in Sanctuary. I just came here to um, get some shift codes. I'm going to use one of these, let's say, every two levels, starting at level 10. All right, and uh, this will give you like um, some really cool weapons. How do you get ship codes? Let's do it right now. Exit to the main screen. You have to be online to do this, right? Go down to extras and go to ship codes. Because I'm offline, I won't be able to do this, but once you get to that ship's code screen, you get some form fields to fill in where you can enter ship codes and just um, do a search in Google for Borderlands 2 ship codes and you can plug those in and use those to get some golden keys and you get a whole bunch at a time 10 or 15 at a time and you can use these golden keys in the special golden chest and get some really kick butt weapons All right? so I'm going to use like one of those like let's say every two two or three levels starting at level 10 All right let's get to it let's do plan B and this starts off with hooking up with Scooter the mechanic Sanctuary. Built on the ruins of the Dahl Corporation's finest interplanetary mining ship. Now the last refuge for thieves, murderers, and outcasts. Welcome home. Thank you. Oh, crap. Is you that Perrin? I heard all of you were robots and you eat metal out the garbage and stuff. Knew you wired death machines be come for me once Roland went missing. Now, if you're here to kill me, you should probably know. You'll never take me alive, you robotic stone bitch! Yeah. All right. Scooter, my man. A minute. Ha! Well, hang me upside down. Now, you gonna help us out with this rolling situation? I heard them Crimson Raider dudes talking about it. Roland told me if you ever disappeared, I was supposed to initiate Plan B. Or as I like to call it, Plan Turn This City into a floating ass fortress of airborne awesomeness. Ha <laughs> ha! B. <laughs> I got some fuel cells around here. You'll need those. Oh, and you'll need this uh, iridium here too. Alright, get some rid rock from Scooter. And get the fuel cell here. Let's go upstairs. Let's well, get the second fuel cell. More red rock, thank you very much. You're gonna need a third, which is why I gave you that here red rock. Uh, you can buy the last cell from Earl's Black Market. Careful though, Earl's crazy. He ate one of my cars once. Yeah, the whole car. Like with the floor. Okay, let's make this quick and painless. I got a whole route worked out here. Bandits of Sanctuary. Lots to do in Sanctuary. I hear a new Vault Hunter has arrived in your city, so just turn him into me and you'll be rewarded. First Don't worry, cell goes nobody's here. gonna turn you in. You're our only hope of stopping Jack. Hmm? Roland said we gotta have an exit strategy <laughs> just in case he ever disappeared and sell fuel sales and whatnot. Eh, uh, bummer though. He really wanted to meet you. Raiders ain't gonna last without some new blood, and given how you shot them bandits up, I'd say you and blood got an extra special relationship. This is a recorded message to any Crimson Raiders in the area. Get a mission Sanctuary out the has been targeted board. by four Hyperion spies masquerading as bandits. They're hiding out in Three Horns. Find them, kill them, and see if you can figure out why they're here. Okay, and this kicks off the mission to assassinate the assassins. Let's hook it up back to Plan B. Next in Plan B, hook up a scooter and buy what something. You want? Maybe I got it. And I'll toss in this crap fuel cell. <laughs> Just touching it made two of my fingers right off. I only accept iridium. Cash is for clowns, boy. Okay, I'm gonna buy an SMG SDU. Maybe that helps you kill stuff. Bro. And a backpack SDU. <laughs> yeah, what a sucker! Don't you go back. <laughs> Damn, what a sucker! <laughs> Gotta love it. Let's go pick up a mission from Sir Hammerlock in Moxie's. Vault Hunter, Bullymon. Rubbish name, isn't it? I try the slots one time. 
Nothing. And he craps out. Uh oh. Shapes of things to come. Next, let's go see Marcus. But on the way, we'll do a little shield shopping and see if we can get a decent class mod for Maya. Welcome to Dr. Zed's Portable Clinic. What can I get? Fantasy class mod. Not really what I'm looking for. Um, I would like to have a turtle shield with a pretty low recharge delay. So something like a quick turtle shield. No, we can do better. And those won't do. Let's go see Marcus. Could, could I have a refund, please? This gun doesn't seem to work. Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> Looks like it works to me. All right. First of all, let's do some shopping. Let's see if we can pick up a Malawan sniper. No such thing. Okay, and let's do this mission here. This will quickly level us up. If you're gonna be a part of the crimson. Raiders, you better know how to use elemental weapons, don't, don't you, think? you think? I've just got a crate of spiking new Malawan elemental weapons. Wanna help me test them out? Sure. Now, burn that in. Aha, fire and flesh. Turn this in. This the next one. This Iberian fascist thinks he's safe because he's got a shake back, Jack Lover. Yeah, a few. Hmm, now what else? Oh, nice uh, 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 to like these damn Hyperion robots. <laughs> now let's and we try out up. these new slag. Now that he's slagged, he should be easy enough to finish off. Switch to another weapon and hit him again. Great. The weapons work, and you're ready if you want to there purchase. Awesome. The quick XP. I'm gonna save that. Uh, like <clears throat> pardon me, perk point to see how things play out with dealer. stuff I get. From shopping. Next, let's go install the third fuel cell. And go see Roland. Hi, thanks for grabbing all that stuff for me. Third degree burns are best taken in shifts. Now, to see the fruits of your loins, this city is gonna fly! Once again, looking for a uh, Malo and Sniper. Or not. Damn. Well, now we really gotta find Roland. You know what? Maybe get to Roland's place? I think he might have left a message there for you. Okay, dude. Does Would Roland have a message for Crimson me? Raiders run stop. Thank you very much. In we go. And this will complete the mission. Hey, soldier. And this. and this will give us an extra slot. That's exactly the way I like, sir. This I don't want. I'm in trouble. Right now, you're the only thing standing between this city, hell, the whole planet, and Handsome Jack's army. Sorry, I'm interrupting the uh, dialogue here. This I've decided is not going to do us any good. Uh, this can go as well. I left info about my whereabouts in my safe. You can use it to store anything you need. This is your home now. Good luck. All right, let's hit up the safe. This is the Firehawk. Cut the Frostbite Canyon, or people will die. The Firehawk? You mean the mass murderer and bounty hunter? Oh, crap! If the Firehawk's got him, Roland's in danger. You gotta get to Frostburn Cannon and rescue his ass! If Roland has been captured by the Firehawk, he's in danger. You're the only one who can stop Jack, but Roland is the man with the plan, so to speak. 
He knows the best way to strike at Hyperion. No rid rock in Patty's place. Okay, we're gonna be back momentarily, Patty. Hmm. This isn't bad. This isn't bad at all. Let me get it for free. Cool. Okay. You're gone and we don't need you. You can never be too well armed. Let's go see Zed. Nope. Actually, let's go see Claptrap first. That's another um, easy XP. We'll get that later. Let's go already. A quest? Minion, over here. Your master commands you. You helped me reach Sanctuary, Minion, and for that, you deserve a reward. I have a secret stash hidden very, very far away from where I currently am. In order to find it, you will have to perform a series of devious challenges. Okay, First, what do I have to do? Collect a few brown rocks for me. Then, uh -huh. defeat a badass skag. Then, pilfer the lost staff of Mount Schuler. Then, you shall bring me the head of the Destroyer of Worlds. And then, you shall dance for my enjoyment. <laughs> or, we could just go to your secret stash and open it up oh, like this. Crap! It, uh... Looks like the hiding space of my super secret stash just fell apart, yeah. leaving it completely exposed. Yeah, some so, quick congratulations! XP there, you and let's go see Zed. I'm starving! I want to eat your babies! Son, this might sting a bit. Alright, now this is where cat class mod. This is exactly what I was looking for. Beautiful. Not the best, but uh, that's great. That's just perfect for the, the weapon we're about to get. What else you got? How much is it? That's reasonable. Okay, great. Now, um, we already have a pretty decent shield, but... Let's take a look anyways. And I jumped all over that cat class mob without checking the other machine first. I should have checked this. Me if you wanna live. Okay, Zephyr Man. I got it. Hey, Roland's boys caught this Hyperion jerk bag trying to sneak into the city. Looks like they messed up his lugs. Dude needs surgery bad. Get over here. You're gonna be my operating assistant. Operating assistant, okay. All right, make a small incision just below his sternum. But be careful. We don't want to nick the coronary artery. Okay, make a very small incision and be very, very careful. <laughs> Close enough. Finish with an iridium shard. Oh, for how many times I tell you, idiots, you can't get slack powers by swallowing this stuff. Well, that shard ain't no good in the black market. It didn't refine yet. You could probably take it to that Tannis lady on the other side of town. She's real into that iridium stuff when she ain't acting all poor. As I've said, Roland, now that Jack has the vault key, it is only a matter of time until he opens the vault. Also, I require a new ventilator. This lab smells of bacon. Bacon is for sycophants and products of incest. <laughs> well, just call me a sycophant hillbilly because I love real bacon. Doctorate. Oh, and let me know if you're looking for work. I got stuff needs doing. Okay. Hey, Patty. After hours of scientific and... Uh, God as my witness, one day I will find a usable spleen. Okay, everybody's stepping all over everybody else's dialogue here. 
Uh, this will complete this. He has already looted patties. And now there should be one last mission back at Zed's medical mystery. Look, you know what can make a bullet hole that ain't a bullet? Because I freaking don't. I've been seeing some confusing wounds coming from Three Horns. Head down there and find out what kind of weapon's causing them. An old rival of mine named Doc Mercy's using it. But don't let that name fool you. Unlike me, he's more interested in creating wounds and patching them up. Also, unlike me, he actually has a medical license. <laughs> Alrighty then, so... Jammed off all the side missions and plan B, uh, 15 minutes flat. And these are all our new missions. This is the main mission. This is one we got from Zed. This is one we got from Sir Hammerlock. And this is the one we got off the bounty board. We're going to attack this one first and go out to Frostburn Canyon. And uh, do we need ammo? No, we do not. This is what we're going with. And tell you what, let's go. First of all, let's spend this point since we didn't get anything I wanted for another strategy I've worked up. Let's put another point into Mind's Eye, increase our critical head damage, and let's spend a golden key and see what we got. Eight months, dang it. Okay. I already have good grenades. I mean, this thing is like, you know, it's gonna be hard to top. However, <laughs> I'm trying to make use of these because, I, you know, a uh, sticky, a sticker grenade, that could be useful, I think, maybe. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna sell that one and keep this and stash the sticky grenade. I don't think it's gonna be of any use right now. The hell with it. Let's sell them. Guns, glorious guns. Yeah, I, I, I just can't see this outperforming my uh, lobs bonus package. Yeah, so. How's that? We're ready, Freddy. Off to Frostburn Canyon. What's a red rock count? We got one, so we can't really do anything extra. This is going to be a mountain My sniper weapon here. machines will fix that for you. Check back oh. later to see my new <laughs> weapon of the day. All right, Derby Bower. Wee. Uh, five forty me twins. Awesome. Okay. Uh, 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 yep. All right. Let's make this quick and painful. <laughs> Grenade out. Just let the package do the work. Interesting. You're a pyro. I hate pyros. Up you go. And down you go. Yeah. <laughs> 
Fine. Oh, somebody's left? Good on ya. Good on ya. Hold, hold up here. I hate pyros. You get a package. Eh? Yeah. Nobody burns my ass and gets away with it. Nobody. Okay, so there's no chest in here, just, you know, a little bit of chump loot here and there. That's enough of that. Let's go into Frostburn Canyon. Should be around here somewhere. Stay alert. All right. That's weird. The bloodshot bandit camp seems to be attacking the Firehawk's lair. They've probably left landmarks for their reinforcements. Those should lead you to the Firehawk. That, or just follow the screaming. Done. Okay. Hope you've had your shots. Nothing doing here, and this is top off our bullets. And this is we're going to pick up next video. We're going to go on a massive weapon hunt here in Frostburn Canyon. Lots to pick up, a lot of chests to hit. I know exactly where they all are, including a couple of hidden ones, including one I found like this morning for the very first time after all these years of playing Borderlands. I never knew about this chest. That's all coming up next video. I want to thank you all very much for watching. See you next video. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1. That's all. That's all it takes. All right. Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it.